Traumatic brain injuries, TBIs for short, are caused by a sudden blow to the head, which causes damage to the brain and are often accompanied by bleeding inside the head or swelling of the brain. A whole host of serious medical problems can result from TBI, stroke and ep epilepsy among them. It is estimated that every year, one and a half million Americans suffer from traumatic brain injuries caused by falls, auto accidents, sports injuries, and other violent encounters. Many of our veterans have returned from combat in Iraq and Afghanistan with TBIs caused by explosive devices. If you have suffered a TBI and want to apply for Social Security Disability Benefits, it is important to remember that as with most disorders, it is not the name of the impairment that qualifies you for disability benefits, but the symptoms. If the symptoms prevent you from working, some TBIs are hard to diagnose and determine the degree of severity. A traumatic brain injury claim must be supported by medical evidence, such as physical examinations, scans, psychological testing, or lab tests. Additionally, you must demonstrate that you have a significant functional limitation as a result of your TBI, which prevents you from performing any of your past work or any type of work because of your age, education, and skills that might qualify you for. TBIs are different from other impairments. It is often difficult to assess long-term outcomes after a brain injury. Social Security recognizes this. With other impairments, individuals cannot receive disability benefits until they have been unable to work for at least 12 months. But with TBIs, Social Security may judge a person as disabled as soon as three months after a serious injury to the brain. There are many more rules and conditions governing TBI and disability. Our experience has shown that TBI disability cases are complex and difficult, but they are winnable. Call us for a free evaluation of your case. At Cuttigan Law, you have a dedicated team of professionals in your corner who understand the system and who will fight for your rights.